at what is the temperature of a gas. The temperature of a gas is a measure of the average kinetic energy and its particles. What materials do we need? The materials that we need on our experiment are three beakers and two thermometers. We also need ice, warm water, and hot water. Now, we will begin the experiment. Pour approximately 100 ml of water in a breaker. First trial. Measure the initial temperature of the air just above the water's level. Fill the breaker with the crushed ice up to the water level. After 5 minutes, measure the temperature of the air just above the water level. Heat the water until it boils and get the temperature of the air just above the water level. Second trial. Salt. Question number one. Is there a difference in the temperature of air among the three setups? Yes. Heat flows from the system to the surrounding or vice versa. If the water is cold, the surrounding air also gets cold. Conversely, if the water is hot, the surrounding air also gets hot. To prove that gases have temperatures that changes, the following conditions are considered room temperature, low temperature, and high temperature. Low temperature is achieved by exposing the air to water full of ice. On the other hand, high temperature is achieved by exposing the air to boiling water. It is expected that the temperature of the air above the cold water level is the lowest, while the air above the boiling water is the highest. It is also considered that when the volume increases, the temperature also increases. Question number two. Explain the difference in temperature of air. The temperature of the air is a measure of how quickly the molecules are moving. The more energy of motion the molecules have, the higher the temperature you feel in the air. In our experiment about the gases and its temperature, low temperature air is achieved by exposing the air to the water full of ice. On the other hand, high temperature is achieved by exposing the air to the boiling water.